Guys, I got this scooter for free. It's 50cc, it's gonna be a lot of fun to clean it up. So stick around for the ride and let's get into the video. I have no idea about modifications or anything for these scooters. I haven't even seen any videos on YouTube. I'm just doing this for a bit of fun, guys. So stick around for a laugh. Um, obviously, I gotta clean it up, give it a bit of a wash. And yes, I got it for free. Um, it's got like a little bit of damage, like just rust damage here and a crack. There we go. Crack damage right there. Um, but besides that, it's just a little bit faded on the, uh, the like the black or grey plastics. We can fix that up, clean it all up. Um, there's a bit of a crack down there. So I got this for free from my stepdad. He literally bought it. He drove it about three times because he wanted it to drive from the yacht club to his house and then didn't drive it for six years and he was going to give it away and he just said, hey Mez, you want it? So I'm going to get this thing started. It doesn't start yet. And uh, so yeah, it just needs a bit of TLC. If you're wondering where the Hilux videos are, I have the exhaust ready here. Um, I'm just struggling to get the old exhaust off. Uh, it's all rusted and old. And this, remember this car has 300,000 Ks on it. So I've actually contacted the people that um, I got the exhaust off to see if they can lend me a helping hand and you know get it all together because it's really hard in my driveway to do this without the right tools. So as you can see, it's pretty dirty and dusty and stuff. So I'm probably just gonna start by washing it and giving it a once over and then uh, pretty sure the battery's stuffed. So I'm gonna have to open that up and see what's in there, see if the battery's stuffed or not. Uh, maybe I might be able to charge it. And then, um, yeah, I just wanna give it a clean up. And then I think I might try and get it started this episode. I'm not sure, depending on my time frame. it is Christmas Eve tomorrow. So the wheels are kind of like scuffed. As you can see, they're like rusting and stuff. So. Maybe I take them off and uh, sand them down a little bit and then spray them black because this silver is not great. Uh, same on the back. And then um, obviously we need to get an exhaust for it. This thing's a nugget. Probably got a massive cat in there or something, I don't know. And that's the little, little nug hole. <laughs> um, and then I think that's a fan to cool the motor. I'm not sure. I have seriously not even looked at this until now. Um, and then there's some plastics just here. They're just kind of coming apart and I think when I lifted it out of the car all these connectors just came off just here so that should be an easy fix and then um, obviously we have the I don't know what goes actually in here because I'm not used to scooter engines but we can clean up this case cover and uh, spray that black as well um, red shocks that means fast check out this disc brake boys and girls this is a fast scooter I'm just kidding, it's 50cc. This thing is not gonna get me anywhere fast. It's just a bit of fun. Just like that, she is clean. That was literally the easiest clean I've done in my life. And I wish the paint looked like that, but we'll see what it looks like when it dries. Um, it's a little bit faded here, if you can tell. And uh, yeah, but it's looking good, guys. So let's start tearing down and see if the battery's stuffed and uh, see what else I need to work on with this thing. I reckon I need to put some oil uh, where the piston is just in case it's a bit seized and uh, yeah, we'll see all right So I have the battery on charge. I'm hoping that it's okay uh, If not, I'll have to chop out and get a new battery and I think they're like a hundred dollars, which is annoying, but that's all right um, The scooter's looking pretty clean um, I'm not really a fan of the gray plastic, so I probably will try and clean them up I'm not sure um, if I'll paint them black or whatever you guys let me know down below um, the red paint is looking awesome. I actually am pretty bummed that I couldn't get a Hilux episode out for you guys because I know you guys actually love the Hilux build. Um, it's doing super, super well. You guys are smashing it with views, comments, likes, and all that stuff. And uh, I seriously can't thank all the members as well. You guys are jumping on board, supporting me. Um, if you don't know about that, members is just a way to support myself and the podcast as well. So it supports Zach, Adam, James, and whoever else comes and hosts as well. So you can start as little as $2.99 all the way up. You get an awesome badge. You start off as an SR20 engine. You get an LS1 engine, a Barra, RB26, two JZ, and that's for 12 months. And then for 24 months, I think I'm gonna go with a 1HZ or some sort of diesel engine that you guys love. So let me know down below what engine you'd like to see as a sub badge. 
and uh, yeah, hopefully I can get more of this content out. Um, might try and do some funny stuff with the Hilux as well. But let's get back to the scooter. I don't know if it was going to start this episode because of the charging, but we'll see. So I'm just looking at the uh, the Ks it's driven. It says 12,147. Doesn't really make sense. Maybe someone owned it before my stepdad. It is a 2005, so I'm not really sure, but I don't know. I swear he's he's only ridden it a few times, so maybe someone before him uh, traded it in for like a new scooter or something, but that's a lot of Ks for a 50cc uh, two-stroke. So I just drained all the fuel, and that's the color of it. Um, yeah, that's quite bad. It must have been sitting in there for a while, and um, while I was getting the, the fuel line off, it snapped. It's quite frail anyway, so I'm just gonna replace that at some point. I don't know if I'll get that done before Christmas, which sucks. Um, I was hoping to get this started for you guys this episode. Um, it's a bit of a letdown, I know, but I'm gonna get grinding, get the exhaust on, get this, and I have a lift coming for the Hilux as well, so get keen, guys. That Hilux is gonna look so, so sick soon. It's gonna have some awesome flex, and uh, hopefully I've got a bit of a bull bar and a winch set up coming as well. Um, I'm just trying to confirm that as well. All right, guys, I know it was nothing special in this video, again. Um, I'm gonna try and, try and do something good with the Hilux this weekend or something, see if I can make some sort of funny urban four-wheel drive video. I don't know how well that'll go, but we'll see. Um, hopefully you like the little nugget series. Uh, I don't know if it, how long it's gonna go, what's gonna happen with it, but um, it's just a bit of fun. Um, I might just end up putting it in with the Hilux videos if um, that's if you guys don't want to see like full videos just on the scooter. And then obviously, gotta still fix this nug after drift day. It's uh, still not running. I uh, still want to get Club Rego on it as well. Um, so if you stuck around this long, thank you so much for watching the video. Um, <laughs> just a bit of a joke, guys. A bit of fun, and uh, hopefully I made you guys laugh. If you like the video, hit like. And if you're not subscribed, hit subscribe. Thank you so much for almost 2,600 subscribers. See you guys in the next video. Peace.